We're back with more of the breaking news. What you're seeing right here is the image of a car that's rolled over. That car inside of it was Tiger Woods, golf legend Tiger Woods. They had to use the jaws of life. Paramedics and the fire department had to use the jaws of life to get Tiger Woods out of that car. He was taken immediately to a local hospital. It's unclear the extent of his injuries, but you can see from the accident right there, a lot of damage to the car um, and that it was clearly an urgent situation to get him out, out of that car as quickly as they did. Um, this happened just after 7 a.m., 7.12 a.m. on the California coast, so Pacific time. It happened on Hawthorne Boulevard and Black Horse Road. It's near uh, Palos Verdes and the Rolling, Hill, Rolling Hills Estates in Southern California. Joining me now is NBC News investigative reporter and an uh, reporter Andrew Blankstein. Um, Andrew, what more do we know? Hi, Katie. Well, we know this was a two-car collision. What we don't know exactly and is being sorted out in this investigation is exactly uh, who uh, hit who first. Um, at this point, we know that Tiger Woods sustained significant injuries and was taken to Harbor UCLA Medical Center nearby in Torrance. At this point, uh, nothing more on that front. And then in terms of the investigation on the traffic collision is ongoing. Um, and Tiger Woods was the only person in his car? Uh, that's, that's what we know at this point, yes. Yeah. Do we know anything more about who might have been in the other car? How many? No, no additional de Yeah, no, no additional details on that. Um, again, the investigation has been going now for uh, about an hour and change. Uh, in terms of who was responsible, uh, the you know other parties. No additional on that. And, Andrew, it happened at 7.12 a.m. Do we have any idea how quickly um, medical personnel, rescue teams, were able to get on scene and, and how long it might have taken? I realize that this is all happening as we speak and we're getting updates, but how long it might have taken to get Tiger Woods out of that car? Uh, when, whenever you employ the jaws of life, obviously the extent of the the collision, um, it, was, it was from what – Sources have told me, obviously, very serious, and and that that would take time. They don't have an exact uh, time from arrival to when he was extricated and then taken to the hospital. But uh, obviously, with a rollover crash and, and a collision like that, it's going to take time to get somebody out. And those are details that we're trying to gather as we speak, um, in addition, again, to kind of what led up to this. Why? Uh, you know, Andy, when when, I, when we're looking at these uh, these wide shots uh, from from the helicopter, these these aerials, I'm not seeing another car in this screen. The L.A. County Sheriff's Office uh, Department has said that this was a single vehicle rollover. Um, are we sure that there was another car? Is it just the single ve vehicle rollover for this car in particular? Because I, again, I don't see another car when we when we widen out. Andy, you still there? We're trying to get a sense of exactly what happened. There's been kind of, uh, there's been the official statement. There's been some things that of sources have said. So we're just, we're trying to obviously determine uh, exactly what happened. Okay, again, to reset for anybody who might just be joining us, we're covering breaking news out of California on golf star Tiger Woods. A Los Angeles County Sheriff's Office says Woods has been injured in a rollover car accident. You can see the car on your screen right there. Police say Woods was the only person in that car. And that, as again, you can see, it sustained major damage. The authorities needed to use the jaws of life to free him with the help of firefighters and paramedics. Woods was rushed to the hospital. The extent of his injuries is still unclear.